p.m. We begin with a live look over Pfizer Forum, where in 271 days, the Republican National Convention will take over the Milwaukee area. For four days, starting July 15th, Milwaukee will be the center of the political world as the Republican Party selects its nominee for president. And tens of thousands of visitors are excited to infuse, expected rather, to infuse hundreds of millions of dollars into the city's economy. Good evening and thank you so much for joining us. I'm Natalie Shepard. 271 days, but who's counting? Right, right. Not to I'm, be specific. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jessa Breisbeck. We appreciate you being there. Today, a lot of the vendors that are partnering with the city got together for a kickoff event to build momentum leading into the RNC. The CBS 58's Adam Reif is live outside Pfizer Forum to show how the RNC is helping the city's businesses. Adam. Natalie Jessup, those 271 days are going to come very quickly for many people in this city. Let's talk numbers for a brief moment. 50,000 visitors are expected to come to Milwaukee for the convention. At any given time, 18,000 of them will be inside Fiserv Forum. That leaves more than 30,000 people outside the arena in Milwaukee and the surrounding areas. A big opportunity for local businesses. Tonight, it was a toast to Milwaukee as the host committee and the RNC unveiled resources available to those businesses. It will be the, the city that does not sleep during the convention. And there will likely be many sleepless nights leading up to it too for thousands of business owners looking to capitalize on huge convention crowds. More than 1,500 Milwaukee vendors have already signed up for an online vendor portal. About 120 are listed in the official venue guide. To showcase Milwaukee as a place to live, work, and play. That guide will show each of the thousands of visitors what Milwaukee has to offer as they plan their visit. Lakefront Brewery's Russ Klish said they'll be loaded for bear. Klish sees an opportunity to rent out his space to groups looking for a breakfast or lunch venue, even a convention after party. They're putting us out in front of everybody, so anybody who's very serious about having a, a, a big event is going to be looking at that portal. While summer 2024 may seem like a long way away, there are signs things are starting to ramp up. And just as the businesses will soon prepare for the influx in crowds, so too will the security teams. Soon the U.S. Secret Service and RNC will focus on the community impact. Whether it's food screening, uh, how some road closures or the perimeter might impact uh, egress or, or things with their staff. Elise Dickens with the RNC says Milwaukee is the perfect size city for the convention, but adds it's more than just a welcoming lakefront. I feel like Milwaukee's on the cusp of incredible growth and our delegates and everyone is really excited to be a part of that. Hundreds of events will take place all convention week throughout the entire city, not just Fiserv Forum. And let's cheers. Cheers to you. Thank you for your partnership and let's have a fantastic convention. A fun night there at the Journeyman Kimpton outside. A little bit of rain here, but that's not going to dampen things again. An entire week of events. Now, Russ Klish says one of the things that will help is extending bar hours to 4 a.m. closing times. Right now, it's 2 a.m. He said when the convention ends each night at midnight, that doesn't leave a lot of time for people to get to the bars and spend some money. Extending those hours, he says, will help big time. Live here outside Fiserv Forum, Adam Rife, CBS 58 News. It's going to be a big time for our city, that's for sure.